Hey, Nate. Welcome, welcome back, man. Thank you. Good to be here. Yeah, that's where we are. We're here. That's right. And I've brought you here today for a very specific reason. Okay. Which is for the first time, mm -hmm. I'm just so delighted about this. Momentum Lab, we developed something that is open to the public. Right. Yeah. And I'm really stoked about it. It's launching in the next couple of days. It will have launched the day this podcast goes live. Yeah. And it's called the Elephant in the Room Challenge. Sure. And you're the guy who came up with that language. Yeah. So I'd like you to I'd like you to give our listeners a little sense of what this is all about. Great. It's it, in typical Momentum Lab fashion. It's a little bit tongue in cheek and 100 percent sincere. I would say the elephant in the room points at the the exiled parts of our personality, the places that we are actively ignoring, shunning and rejecting. And I think it can happen in two sort of, just to boil it down, I, I see it most prevalent in sort of two modes. One is it just extremely closeted creativity, repressed creativity. And like your example, um, thinly veiled example of, uh, of us. In the, in the video, which I'll include as part of this episode. So yeah. It's this, you will see that. It's the thing that you're just not doing. I, I had a number of friends that I uh, went to fine arts in a conservatory with. And they graduated and they got right to drug dealing just to be able to make movies and create art. And then 15 years later, they haven't stopped the, their bullshit. Mm. And so it's all the things we do to postpone the thing that's right there for us to do. The elephant in the room is the thing that's right there for us to do, but we're so busy doing everything else. Mm. And so here we're just, and this is, I mean, I think you tell me if I'm wrong, but this is the whole point of Momentum Lab anyways. Yeah. We hope to reveal this. Yeah. Through and it's, it's different happens. scales, right? Like in Momentum Lab, we're really talking about life purpose. Yes. It's, this is something, the challenge is 28 days, it's a month. And it's like, what can we do to look at, reveal, face, confront, be like, all right, what's going on here? And what can I do about it? And it's just another way in to that encounter, to that, that encounter, that glimpse of that thing we're working so hard to ignore. I would say on the other side is all of the activity, all of the tension, all of the effort we put forth in trying to be a good person, a nice guy, do the right thing. And all of the shadow work that's exiled, all of the anger, the repressed anger, the repressed force or aggression, um, competitiveness, and so those are the two things that I think, two places that I think it shows up most immediately, probably for all of us. And it should, in my opinion, my experience working with our clients, give you a little eh, mm -hmm. sense. As soon as, as, soon, as soon as you're even listening to this as a listener, you know what it is. There is that sense. That's what, that's why we call it the elephant in the room. It feels threatening. And you're like, oh, I don't want to talk like about you don't want to add that's anything else, anything but that. And just to entertain the idea that that anything but that is um, costing you decades of your life. Focusing on the anything but that, how much tension and energy and life force we're dedicating to the anything but that. Yeah. So the elephant in the room challenge is to put yourself at least a little bit on the hook here and work with us to find the least threatening example of that, where we can create a little bit of a microscope and just bring some life, bring some energy. And you know this, I know this from running some of these tests, that my experience has been completely the opposite. When I, anytime, and it's not just one thing, you know, I, I think maybe the language is, kind of gives that impression, but we can, we can approach this so many times so many times oh, it's elephants all the way down there's elephants all the way down quite <laughs> yeah, that's right wonderful <laughs> wonderful it is it turns out it is elephants all the way down and so that's our that's our proposition here is that uh you have something like that that uh we're we're creating a space for you to come see it very cleanly safely clearly 
um, with all the challenge and all the support and for us to hold that as as we've learned how to do uh, through facilitating with, with integrity and safety and that's the elephant in the room challenge that's it yeah perfect that's a that's a beautiful beautiful description great yeah and so it starts july 1st and so the idea is to sign up for free today and then you're going to get like a couple emails they're going to help you prep and pick i mean you probably like nick they saying you know what it is yeah and you really you really know what it is and you hate it and you don't want to look at it so maybe these emails are more just like supporting you and giving you the courage to be like to actually do it yeah. some light cajoling some invitation and just hear us that this you know instead of um whatever your fantasy of this thing coming out and blowing up and exploding this is actually a very safe laboratory where you can just test that where you can put it on a small scale see what it's like expose it and and deal with it and actually enjoy the energy sorry actually i don't think i finished my thought earlier but yeah anytime i've done this it's the opposite of my worst fear. Yeah. It actually opens up so much more in my life. There's so much more resources available. Anytime I've taken that risk, exposed, confronted, it's it's only become better and better. Yeah. I mean, it's a classic, you know, I've been doing a lot of podcasts about conflict and conflict avoidance. Sure. It's just classic. The avoidance yeah. is way worse than the conflict. Turns out. Yeah. Who knew? Who knew? Yeah. <laughs> All right. That's it. That's perfect. Thank you, Nate. I'm going to roll the little promo video that we made. Cool. Yeah. That has the thinly veiled references to ourselves. Yeah, very thinly. <laughs> very thin. Thank you all. The point of this challenge is to identify and confront something that's been holding you back for a long time. And usually it's something so painfully obvious to everyone who loves you that when you finally figure it out, it's just embarrassing. Like, oh, I need to get some self-respect and extract myself from this abusive relationship. Or, all right, I've been playing guitar for 25 years in my room by myself. Maybe it's time I play a show. Or why do I self-sabotage every great idea and opportunity that comes my way through never following through, ignoring, or just a total lack of consistency? So this is our five-step formula for how to find and face the elephant in the room. The first part is both the easiest and the hardest part. You sign up for free today. Once you do that, between now and the first of the month, we help you find your elephant and decide how to tame it. Most people already know what their elephant is. And let's say for me, it's something around my relationship with my body. What we're trying to do is pick something small that's gonna go very deep and get right to what the core thing about what is this belief, what is this relationship with myself that needs to change through 10 to 30 minutes a day. Once you figure that out, the bulk of the challenge, the first 28 days of the month is just doing your thing and we help you stay inspired and stay consistent. And all of this happens via email, directly to your inbox, no websites, no logins, nothing like that. It's all about the consistency, and the consistency in our approach comes directly from the inspiration. Step four, at the end of the month, you evaluate for yourself what's changed. And then, depending on how the month went, either you're like, all right, it's elephants all the way down, let's find the next thing to work on, or if you weren't able to succeed, we help you find out why. So maybe you didn't find the right elephant, maybe the intervention wasn't right, maybe the dosage wasn't right. We'll help you figure out what it is so that when the next month rolls around, you can do an even better intervention. So that's what we're doing, Elephant in the Room Challenge. It's quick, it's easy, it's low commitment, it's free. You know, a lot of the other things we do for our clients involve a year of working together or flying to a place for an amazing transformative retreat. But not everyone can do that. Not everyone has the time, not everyone has the money. But this kind of thing, it takes such a low commitment. It can be 10 minutes a day, depending on what you choose. It's less than a month, it's 28 days. There's no reason not to. So we're new to YouTube and we would love your feedback. Please comment, subscribe, follow, tell all your friends and let us know what you think.